Hey, John Cristana here, internet entrepreneur, highly requested speaker around the world, whatever, multimillionaire, all that BS. But I really am gonna show you how to build an email list for free. This is no BS, I'm gonna walk you through it step by step and how you can do it using Gmail. You don't need to even pay for an autoresponder or anything and how you can make money and how we can make money together as well. And I just want to make a word of advice before I get into this video because this is going over some pretty heavy, hardcore stuff. And if you are ready, if you're ready, you're like, show me the good stuff, John. Show me the good stuff. You're going to get the good stuff. And, if, and, and type in black hat in the comments below. Type in black hat if you're like, show me the juicy juice. Okay, because I'm going to show it to you. I'm going to show it to you. Nobody's ever shown this on the internet before, but I'm going to show it to you. But first, a warning. Okay, really important warning. One, I'm not a lawyer, right? You can't take legal advice from me. Also, number two, this video is for entertainment purposes only. I'm a YouTuber, right? And number three is always comply with all laws, right? You can't, you can't, you know, all that stuff. So let's get into it on my computer and I'm going to show you actually how we're going to get a free list, okay? Mail people in Gmail and we can set up multiple groups and how to make money. How much would you like that? How awesome would that be? Let me show you exactly how this works right now. Now, first off, we're gonna be using Gmail, so make sure you're signed up with Gmail or you get a Gmail account. Anybody from anywhere over the world can get it. And the other thing we're gonna be using is we are gonna be using, if you click these little buttons right here, we are going to be using Google Contacts to manage our email list. So yes, you can use Google Contacts as your email list, but we will need to import contacts into here in order to actually be able to email people and create our list. Now, once we create our list, we the technical term is we are giving it a label. By the way, any Phi Delts here or any people in a fraternity, if you are in a fraternity or a sorority, shout out your fraternity or sorority here. I, I'm a Phi Delt. Uh, Phi Delta Theta, so I don't know. Who would have guessed I'm a frat guy, right? I love, the fraternities were a lot of fun back in college. So you can import contacts here and you can manage it with different labels and we will create a label later on and I'm gonna show you how. And then I'll show you where you can get emails, how you can sign up to make money sending those emails. Um, and we will be using what's called affiliate marketing through a site called Digistore24 to actually email people and make money from doing it. Okay, so how do we actually make, how do, where, where, where do the contacts come in? Where's the free list? Where we make money? So the site you're gonna wanna go to is you're gonna wanna go to a forum called raidforums.com, okay? raidforums.com and you'll see it right here. I'm gonna verify I'm not a robot. Now the site we'll, we will be using to get the contacts that we send out emails to is called raidforums.com. Now raidforums is a very interesting site to be on and they have a lot of databases here and as you see raidforums.com. Now what we are interested in is going to the databases section right here, okay, databases. And we're gonna click on databases. And what you will see is we have a list here. This is real. Prepare for your mind to be blown. Prepare for the nuclear mind blowing moment. Right here on this webpage, you have access to download 6.1 billion email addresses from 344 breached databases. Now, you might be asking yourself, how the heck are 6.1 billion emails out there? And who else knows about this? Well, first off, not many people know about this. I'm revealing this for the first time in all of YouTube. Second off, how did those emails get out there? How are you just able to download them? And I'm gonna show you how you can download them in just a second. Is the reason they're out there is because there's a lot of database breaches. MySpace has been hacked. Facebook has been hacked. LinkedIn has been hacked. You know, Match.com has been hacked. All of those emails, people, people sell them. 
Okay, so all of the MySpace emails, all 150 million emails, email addresses of MySpace users, for a few years, people sold them on the dark web, on the markets, the underworld markets of data brokers, right? And what happens is over time, that list, that list of emails, it almost becomes common knowledge. Once a file has been passed around for a couple of years to multiple individuals, it just kind of it becomes ubiquitous. People in this, you know, the data sharing community all have a particular file of everybody who's been hacked on MySpace, right? Now, this forum just offers those all for free because everybody has them already, or everybody in that world. And you have access to download them all for free too. Now, let me show you how this is possible and how you can download them and actually use them to create an email list around. Let's get into it. Okay, now in choosing which list we actually download, you'll see right here on the left side is how many records are in them. So you'll see that, you know, Adobe, for instance. Adobe, many of you probably know Adobe, Adobe Photoshop, Adobe Acrobat, which you used to view PDFs. Over 152 email addresses um, from of users of Adobe were uh were leaked back in 2013 and you can have them all okay um but we're not going to use adobe's database because have you ever opened a file which has 152 million rows in it in excel you can't do it it'll actually crash your computer <laughs> i mean excel just doesn't open files like over 10,000 or something so you, you just can't work with that. So any file that's maybe over 100,000 or over 50,000 is gonna be very difficult for you to even open. You're gonna need special programming knowledge, SQL databases and all this stuff to actually be able to use these files. So what we're gonna be looking at is we're gonna be looking at some files. We're gonna choose files that have smaller amounts so that we can actually work with the data and um, manipulate it. Here's, here's a good one. This is alphas.sx forum database. So this was a forum breach that had 8,000 members. The information was hacked and leaked in 2016 and we can download it here. So we're going to click download it here. Now, as you'll see on the site, it's very interesting. You have Apple, one of Apple's databases here. You have cannabis forum database. You have, you know, you have, you have a lot of, you know, experience, you know, you have a lot of different stuff here. I'm not going to go too deep into this. You have the Alaska voter database. All of these are considered almost public knowledge now that they've been leaked, which is kind of scary. So if you're wondering, is the power, you know, people say Facebook and Google have all this information, so do you. You just need to know how to access it. You do need to know where it is. You need to invest in learning and you can get it too. Now here we are, alpha.sx, and we're gonna click download here to get the database. Now what we see when we go here is we see that it is 8,500 entries and we can click here to download. So we can click download. I believe in order to get some of these things, you either need credits or you need to post messages on the forum in order to get these. Now I've downloaded the database, but in this case, it's a zipped file, which means the, the contents have been compressed so they're smaller. So if you don't have something that can open zip files, you will need to actually search in your computer WinRAR. Okay, WinRAR. And you can go to uh, winrarlab.com uh, and you can click there and you can download it free. So just go over where it clicks downloads and you would just click whatever version is for your particular computer, you know, 32-bit uh, for Windows or maybe you're using Mac or Linux whatever you're using. Now, once you've downloaded WinRAR and you've installed it, uh, you would open up, you, you will be able to open up this file, which is the database I downloaded. And here I am. I'm just gonna extract, extract to my downloads, and I'm gonna open up the folder. And you'll see here that we actually have a file, but it's a TXT file, okay? Which means it's a tab separated file. Now, in order to open this in Excel, you're gonna need to actually change the extension of the file. And in order to do that, what you, what you will need to do, if your computer doesn't already allow you to change the extension of a file, is in Windows, you will need to go to File. You will need to click Change Folder and Search Options right here. Within here, you'll need to click View. And once you're under View, you will need to go down to the checkbox, which says Hide Extensions for Known 
file types. You'll need to make sure this is unchecked, okay? Unchecked for hide extensions for known file types, right there. So once you do that, you will be able to manipulate this file. And what you will do is you will right click and you will click rename on Windows, rename file. And once you click that, you will simply just change this to say CS. V. And it'll say if you change the file name extension, it may become unstable. You want to change it and we will click yes. Now we're going to open it in Excel or whatever your favorite file thing is. Okay, now here we are inside of the file and what you'll notice is there's a lot of messy data and this is kind of what happens with a lot of data breaches, but we will notice we have emails. Okay, we have a lot of emails and you can see the emails are in here and there's thousands and thousands of emails in here along with, you know, the person's username, you know, Lewis Edward, Crucified Filth, the Awesome Man, Grant Demand, etc. And you have a lot more information, you know, what their avatar was, their rewards, how many posts they did. We don't care about any of that information. What we're going to do is we're actually just going to delete all other information. Notice I... I used, I'm, I'm selecting up here and I'm clicking and I'm dragging across and I'm gonna right click and I'm gonna click delete, okay? I'm gonna click delete. I'm just gonna clear all the information we don't need. Because all we're concerned about here is those emails, those beautiful little emails. Now the next step is I'm actually gonna take I'm gonna delete all of the other data that's in here. There's a lot of interesting data. There's language, password data. Look, see, these are their passwords, et cetera. And we're going to delete that information. So now all we're left with is the emails. Now, we don't actually wanna go through, you'll see there's 8,500 emails. And in order to upload these emails, we need to remove these little, these little things right here, just like that. But you don't wanna do that 8,000 times, right? You don't, it's gonna suck. So what we're gonna do is we're simply gonna take one of these characters, I'm gonna click copy, then we'll click find. Okay, so I'm using control F, or we can do, there's a find button. There's a find and replace button somewhere. But I just use control F, or on uh, Apple, it's Apple F, I believe. And I'll just type in this character, I want to replace this, and if we zoom, I, I can't really zoom in. You see there's a little dot there, and we're gonna replace that with nothing, okay? We just don't type in anything. And then we want to click Replace All, right there. Okay, great. It says it made 16,000 replacements. I'm gonna click OK. Now, here we have 8,000 emails. Now, one thing to note is we can only send 500 emails in Gmail in a day. That's one of the limits they have set within their email provider thing. So given that, we're I'm going to only select 499 emails and then delete every other email that goes out. So I'm going to scroll down here until we're at 490. Okay. And then I'm going to delete every other email to the bottom and I'm just going to click delete. And now we have an email list with 490 emails here. And I'm just going to click save. How you like that? How you like that now? You wanted some emails. You wanted a free list. Well, we're gonna set it up. You got your list, right? You got your email list for free. Now you just wanna get it into Gmail. So I'm gonna show you how to set up your group in Gmail right now. But if you're, if you're, if you're loving the value, just type in monster value right down below. Okay, type in monster value. But let's go, but I'm answering your question and we're gonna, I'm, I, I'm the only person showing how to actually do a free email list immediately like that here. So let's get into it. Let's set up our group right now. Now, if you are loving the content and you want more ways to make money, make sure you just slam that subscribe button because I'm going over every single day ways that you can get a part of the massive amounts of money that are being made on the internet. I'm showing you step by step on my computer, just like we are today, exactly how you can go out there and make money on the internet. I wanna help you out because when I was starting out, it was a struggle and it really hurt. And I hope that I make it just a little bit easier for you to get started with your internet business. So let's upload these contacts right now and create our list inside of Gmail. So the next step is we're gonna import our contacts right here. And to do that, we click this button. We're gonna select a file and we can also select a label here. So I'm gonna select a label. 
and we're gonna create a new label and let's just call this demo list and I'm just gonna say how many people are in it, 490, right? So I would say alphas.cx forum 490 and I type that in there and then we have, as you see, that we have a list, we have a list ID, we have our list appearing over here and now we just need to select the file. So we've created a label for it and then we go right here and make feel free to pause the video or slow things down if I'm going too slow or if you need time to implement it. We're gonna select this file, it's the one I just did today, and then we're going to click import, okay? Import right there. We'll wait. Okay, so now here we are. We've up uploaded a lot of emails and what we see is we see some messy emails right here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna select these three didn't import properly. I'm gonna click these little buttons right here. Then I'm gonna click the delete button the delete button right here, and we just delete the bad emails. Okay, but you'll see all of these other ones are, you know, Alice Sawyer 227 at gmail.com and Andres at, we have a bunch of emails. We just build the list for free, right? Now, if you're looking to learn more about how to build an email list that people actually opt into, you can watch some of my other videos on how to use emails to make money or how to build an email list. Okay, now the last step is we just need to email these people and all we need to do to do that is we need to go to compose email just like anything else and we need to type in the name of the label we use. So in this case, alpha and you'll see all of these emails populate in here and if you wanted to send an email to them you could. Okay, you can send up to 500 emails a day. So there you go. You can find more, and if you want to actually make money doing this, what I suggest you do is you watch one of my other videos on affiliate marketing. In particular, you can get all of the information you need by going to johncristani.com backslash jvs, okay? And you'll see on this page, you have all the information you need. You'll need to sign up with ClickBank or Digistore to actually get access to sell my product and earn money together with me. My intention is for us to work together. I would really like a hardworking partner who's willing and interested in implementing these methods to make more money for themselves. And that's one of the reasons why I spend a lot of time training. And if you've been getting massive value from this, type in, type in massive value okay below and i hope you're learning how to make money doing this and you'll make a lot of money selling my product and i'm going to give you i'm not only going to show you exactly how to sell my product i'm going to actually give you the emails that you should be sending out now on my jv page you can sign up one of two ways you can sign up on digistore or you can sign up on clickbank i would suggest digistores first clickbank second then on my page you can also get my email swipe so if you're doing an email if you're sending out emails, you click this button and you get a bunch of emails with all the information you need of what to put in the subject line, what to put in, here's different subject line of options, and what to put in the actual email itself. If you don't know their first name, just say hey. If you don't, you know, if you don't want to use your name, use a pen name and you just replace these links with your affiliate links. That's all there is to it. So you have emails to send out, you have a, you have lists that you can use, you know how to set up labels, you know how to even, you can even segment your list with these labels. You have everything you need to actually start email marketing and you've all done it for free. Woo! That was freaking awesome. I, it spent me, a, it took me a lot of time to actually come up with that method. And if you appreciate these methods for how to make money online, if you appreciate someone here helping you from Malibu, California and America, helping you make money yourself, make sure you hit the like button, make sure you subscribe to the channel, make sure you leave a comment. And if you have questions, make sure you ask a question below and join in my community. And I hope everyone here who's been a long time subscriber, new subscribers like, answer other people's questions, right? I get over 2,000 messages a day right now. I can't respond to everybody, but many of you, you have the knowledge. You've been following me for over a year, so you can answer some of people's questions like, does this work in Nigeria or does this work in India, right? I get those questions every day. I've blocked them, right? But if people ask questions that you know the answer to, help each other out because I really want us all to make money together. Again, 
help each other help and and we're making money together you're getting 90 percent i'm only getting 10 percent of this right here so i think that's more than fair and i'm showing you guys i'm not only only getting 10 percent you know i'm doing training and i'm spending all this money on training like i'm mother Teresa here and i want to help you guys make money so let's get this going and join in the communities we have a discord chat channel now we have a facebook group we have a subreddit and we have a forum for everyone to interact with. I don't know, what do you guys like interacting in the most? Is it Reddit? Is it Discord? Is it Facebook group? Is it a forum? I don't know, just join all of them and I'll figure out who, which one gets used the most and maybe we'll whittle some down. But I can't wait to help you guys all out and make money. I can't wait to see you all implement this to help me make more money, frankly, because I mean, I've, I've, I've just spent the last, last, 20 minutes just throwing money at you right here. So let's all make this together. Like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell if you wanna be informed of the next videos here. Woo! Let's get it.